Hello, I'm Andy, and this is my sister, Abby Kate Homer. This is our episode, Inside Andy. And now, it, this, in this episode, is called Inside Abby. <laughs> we would like to welcome you to our Ohana. Uh, today, we're making a Disney World traditional snack. What are they called, Abby? They're called hamburger spring rolls. Hamburger spring rolls. You take a spring roll and a burger and make them one. We're also going to make pepperoni pizza spring rolls. Yay. I didn't tell you that, but we're also going to make that too. Mm -hmm. Okay, should we get started? Yeah, let's get started. Let's show them everything, the ingredients that they need to make it next. Okay. Mm -hmm. So, here, I'll point and you tell them what we need. We okay. have ketchup, mustard, Ground beef. But if you don't eat ground beef, we, you can also use ground turkey. And pickles, minced onions, shredded cheese, and egg rolls. Egg roll wrappers. Egg roll wrappers. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's make some spring rolls. Um, so Andy and I, we both just washed our hands. And so the first step in making the hamburger spring rolls is we're just gonna brown some meat. Okay, so now our meat is pretty much brown. There's just a little bit that needs to be cooked still. So now we're going to add in some onions to the pan and get those all sauteed up. And then we'll add the other ingredients in a little bit. Okay, and then the next step is to add pickles to our meat and onions. We really like pickles. We're using bread and butter pickles, which are our favorite. So we're going to add probably a little bit more than the recipe calls for. Do you want to add them, Andy? Mm -hmm. So then we're just going to stir it all up. And we're also going to salt and pepper it. Okay, so for this recipe, we're not really using specific measurements. We're just kind of eyeballing it based on what we like. So I know in the recipe, I think it says like a tablespoon of ketchup and a tablespoon of mustard, but we might add a little bit more than that. Add mustard. Yeah. Andy, I think we should taste test it. No. What? How about you taste test it? I will taste test it. Okay. Mm, tastes like a cheeseburger without the cheese. <laughs> We're whisking the egg up so we can make the egg rolls. Seal them up. Seal them up. So, do you want to do the egg part? Okay. Just a little bit so that it seals together. Perfect. And then some on this side. Awesome. And then we're going to take some of this filling. And Andy's going to sprinkle some cheese on top of that. And then you're going to take these two corners, fold them in like that, touch with that egg wash so that it sticks, mm -hmm. and then you're going to fold this, and you're going to wrap it like a burrito. Andy, do you want to tell them the rules of wrapping a burrito? Yeah. Fill, fold, roll, and tuck. I saw it from DuckTales when, when Scrooge McDuck and his family went into a pyramid of mummies, and Launchpad teaches them how to make burritos. Oh, cool. But instead of burritos, we're making egg rolls. Do you want to try to roll on Andy? Yeah. Okay, so. Fill. It goes like fill. And we gotta add cheese. So we're still on fill. Fill. Okay, so take these two corners. Take these two corners. And meet them in the middle. Fold. Yeah. And fill. now. You gotta. Uh, yeah, just uh, a little bit more that way. Roll. And now roll. And then, tuck. Tuck. Perfect. Andy, that looks so good. Okay, so now I'm going to gently, so we have our oil. It's around 300 to 350 degrees. And now we're just gonna gently place some of our hamburger spring rolls in it. Make sure you use tongs because if you use your fingers, you just might burn yourself. So now we're gonna let these cook for about two minutes roughly on each side. Go. 
Okay, so now we're opening up our ingredients to now make the pepperoni pizza one. This tastes strong, guy. You wanna open this? Mm -hmm. Okay, you go. So now we're gonna make the pizza spring rolls. So I'm gonna put a little bit of sauce in this. Just a little bit more. Because you can also, once they're done, you can dip them in sauce too, which I think is what we're also gonna do with the burger ones. Yeah. Put some cheese on there. And then we're gonna take the pepperoni and we're just gonna line it on top like this. Do you think three pieces is enough? Yep. Yep. So then we're gonna do the same thing that we did with the cheeseburger ones and just put a little egg wash on the sides uh -huh. to seal it and up. And fill, fold, roll, and tuck. Fill, fold, roll, and tuck. So we got this recipe um, from another channel. They're called Walking with the Woods. So this really sweet couple. And we got the idea from them because uh, they made it out of like a cookbook that they had just bought. And we thought that they looked really good and we really wanted to try it. So we'll link their channel down below so that you guys can check out their video. So I kind of forgot to film this part, but we just took them out and look at how awesome they look. They're nice and crispy. So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna fry up the rest of what we have. We're gonna make some more pepperoni pizza ones, maybe some cheese pizza ones. Um, and then we'll do a taste test. So we made them. So I made, <laughs> so I made some little dishes with pizza sauce for the pepperoni pizza one and ketchup for the hamburger one. Let's cut into them. Should we cut into them? Mm -hmm. Okay. Ready? I'm not sure which one's which. I'm just not good at cutting into them. Ooh. It's a cheeseburger one. Should we try this one first, Andy? Okay, I'm ready. Ready? I'm going to dip mine in a little bit of ketchup. Cheers. Mmm. <laughs> mmm. That's pretty good. That's good. That's pretty good. Oh, we went in for a second bite. It's really good. We put a lot of pickles in it. You can really taste the pickles. Go ahead. Okay, so now I think this is a pizza one. Oops. Yeah. That's totally a pizza one. Let's see if we can get a cheese pull at all. Ooh, look at that cheese. Just put that right back in. Whoop. It's a little hot. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna dip mine in a little bit of pizza sauce. Okay, ready? Cheers. Cheers. Oh, it's pretty good. I like that. No. Andy's not a fan. <laughs> That's really good. I think we should have put a little bit more sauce in it. Mm. <laughs> but we have this little dipper. I like it. Okay, guys, this is what they look like. I'm so happy with how they tasted. I'm so happy with how they turned out. On a scale of one to 10, I would probably give them like, probably like an 8.5, just because they were super quick and easy, but putting them in the oil was something I'm not used to because in our household, we don't really fry things that often in oil. So that was something different and new and a little stressful at times when the oil would start to like bubble over. So I took a little bit off for that, but they taste really good. Um, some tips and tricks um, that I would suggest when making these, if you decide to make these, cause they're very yummy, is that when you're folding them, make sure that you put the, the filling on like a diagonal so that you can roll it easier. And we ended up having a lot of extra filling for the hamburger one. So something I think I'm probably gonna do with that is I'm just gonna whip up some Kraft macaroni and cheese, throw that topping on top, maybe a little bit of cheese. And I feel like that'll be really yummy and a good way to not waste the topping because we ran out of wonton wrappers, as you can see. Um, make sure that you guys check out Walking with the Woods because they were the inspo for this video. So we'll link them down below, like I said before. Make sure you check out their channel and watch their video because they also did an awesome job. Um, make sure that you guys like, comment, and subscribe because so that we know if you guys like these types of videos so that we can make more of them. Maybe we can do like a little food Disney making series. So yeah, just let us know. Thank you guys for watching and we'll see you guys later.